Hi everyone, this is Mazar. I'm an educator. In this video, I'm going to give you tips to self-introduce yourself when facing an interview and it would be very helpful for the new aspirants and the existing teachers who are looking for a role in any country in India or abroad or in Gulf countries. Over the years, since I've been teaching for almost over a decade now in Gulf countries, one thing that any aspirant or the teacher who is appearing for the interview, keep it in mind that the rote learning would not help you out. What stands you apart from others is nothing but the thing that has to come from your heart. You have to be genuine, of course, and give examples. Like, let's say, when you introduce yourself, how are you going to say? Like, do you say that what are your hobbies in or not? No. What, what you need to understand is the role that you are applying. What are the specific challenges or any accomplishments that you have faced? or you got it that you have to put in i mean you have to strike it he will not entertain and listen to what all you have to say and what all you got in just mention be very specific give examples as and when like for instance as a math teacher how am i gonna introduce myself to the interviewer my name is mohammed mother sharif i'm a mathematics teacher i've been teaching for almost over 15 years now in India and in Gulf countries. Currently, I live in Abu Dhabi and working in Indian school. I have earned a master degree with mathematics as my majors. And to qualify myself to teach in the high school for grades 9 to 12, I have earned a professional degree, that's bachelor's of education with maths and English as my majors. What motivates me to teach is that I not only have a passion, it has become a part of me and it makes me a lifelong learner. I enjoy teaching adults, the youngsters in school. I meet the demand of profound understanding of the classroom practices with desire, dedication, and concrete preparation. Why I chose math as a subject to teach is because of its logical reasoning and it develops the aptitude. It requires a lot of reasoning ability of the students, which in today's 21st century we say it as a critical thinking skills and above all this subject has a more of a real life applications and I lastly I'd like to thank the opportunity for introducing myself and that's how you're gonna end your self introductory speech I hope this video helps you uh, in preparing for your interview thanks for watching